So while we're in the form as well, I have been touching here some buttons that I didn't explain. Uh, one of them is called expand and collapse questions. As you can see here, for each question, you have a small arrow here that get you in and out of all the options that you have to choose. But of course, in this form, I have so many, so many that it may take very long to scroll it down. So you just click in expand and collapse. All of them collapse and then you just, you're left up only with the questions. So it's much simpler. And then if you click again, all of them come. And this is to preview the form that you have done again and again. It's just that you click here and that the form will be previewed for you. So you can try if everything is working as it should. And then you have also um, creating groups that uh, we're not going to create right now. The next thing that I have been doing and didn't explain is that here, of course, you have to save. Now, you don't need internet access to work in the form. Once you have loaded, it's, uh, it's offline. So you can connect, disconnect your computer and then connect again to save if you have low bandwidth or if you have like restricted access or whatever. So you can, as long as you don't uh, turn off the, close the, the window, the form will be here and then you can update it anytime you want. And then uh, another interesting question is, the printout. So we have said that uh, you should be doing a printouts of the of the form, like having it done in paper before you actually put it into uh, Kobo Toolbox or whatever other option you would be using for mobile data collection. But here you can also print the final version. So you can click in preview the form and then you have here the small um, printer. And then within this printer, you can come here and print it. Uh, you can save it as a PDF or you can actually straight away print it from your printer. And then in here is maybe when we can also uh, look, have a look at this uh, questionnaire, how it looks and uh, what can we do? Uh, what do we realize? So for example, here, this is in, in gray. It's great. So because it's a, uh, uh, a question that has a um, skip logic. So if other specify, so only if you tick here, you will get this one, but in paper, it has to be printed just in case you need it. It's the same here, 2.20 ZB other precise, and then uh, things like that. All of them, all of these, for example, are not compulsory. If you don't have a hand washing device nearby, you don't get these questions and so forth and so forth. Okay, uh, what 